Senegal's main opposition leader, Usman Senko, has been handed a six month suspended sentence and a $300,000 US fine. The leading opposition politician, who intends to run in next year's presidential elections, was found guilty of defaming the country's tourism minister and was given a two month suspended prison sentence earlier in March. But the prosecution called for a heavier sentence following an appeal. Mr. Senko did not appear in court on Monday for the appeal hearing and announced he would no longer respond to court invitations unless his security could be assured by the Senegalese officials. The court ruling was marred by small protests from the supporters of Senko in Dakar, but riot police were quick to quell the agitation with tear gas. Political expert in Senegal proceeded that Senko may likely get excluded from the 2024 presidential election under the Electoral Code on Candidate Eligibility if he does not challenge the new sentence accordingly. Senko is also facing a rape case involving a beauty saloon employee. He denies all wrongdoing, but the outcome of the case could also affect his electoral eligibility. Senegal has witnessed a series of protests over the decision of the incumbent president, Macky Sall, to run for re-election in 2024. The country's constitution only allows a ruling president to preside for two terms, but some fear Mr. Macky Sall will use a recent adjustment to the constitution to reset his mandate, which ends in 2024, allowing him to run again. A number of human rights organizations have expressed concern about the country's tense atmosphere and limitations on the right to assemble and freedom of expression. The groups also urged President Sao to drop his third term campaign because he hasn't said whether he will run in 2024. Kamil Sadiq, CBA TV.